3D printers are the future of printing technology. A couple of years ago, no one knew anything about 3D printing. However, things are dramatically changing and people know a lot about 3D printing now. In this video, we are going to take a look at the best 3D printers for miniatures you can buy. Links to all products mentioned in the video are available in the description. If you have other products you'd like us to review, please tell us in the comments below or visit 9to5printers.com. Without further ado, let's jump right into it. Three Ultimaker Two Plus. If you need the best 3D printer for miniatures and you don't care about the price point, the Ultimaker Two Plus is the one for you. Quality is always necessary for a 3D printer for miniatures, because you'll need the printer to be built to high standards to achieve the precision you're looking for. While this printer may be expensive, the construction is unmatched, which means that you won't be. While this printer might be expensive, the construction is unmatched which means that you won't only be able to make miniatures, but also custom bits for them. If you want to be able to swap out weapons, armor bits, or anything else on your miniatures, the Ultimaker 2 Plus should work perfectly. If you plan on making miniatures of different sizes, then you'll find that the quick swap nozzles are much more convenient than the ones on other 3D printer models. All you have to do is pop off one of the three nozzles and then replace it with a larger or smaller one to get the precision or speed that you need. 2. Hectop CR-10S If you're looking to save as much money as possible on your new 3D printer, this model from Hectop is the best option on this list. You may be concerned about losing out on functionality with this product, but you may be surprised by it. As you would expect from other low-priced 3D printers, th this model isn't exactly meant to be user-friendly for people who have never 3D printed before. However, if you have the dedication, you can learn to work with this 3D printer in a relatively short period, and you'll be making quality miniatures before you know it. Thanks to the dual lead screws on the Z-axis, you'll be able to benefit from some of the best precision from a 3D printer in this price range. As you would expect while printing miniatures, the level of detail you can achieve is integral, and this model will give you the best results for your money. You may be surprised by some of the advanced features that come included with this 3D printer, such as the warning when the filament has nearly run out. The CR-10S can also resume a printing job after a power outage, ensuring that you won't lose your filament and hard work. 1. Bybo 3D Printer of course, if you're going to be printing out miniatures for war games or RPGs, you also end up needing some terrain pieces. Unlike miniatures, you won't often find terrain that looks exactly like what you need at hobby shops or other sources, so being able to make your own is crucial. The Bible is an excellent choice for anyone looking to make a combination of miniatures and terrain for their tabletop. The key feature which enables this is the inclusion of dual extruders, which are designed to improve the printing speed of your objects while still maintaining consistent quality. A feature which helps make this product even more versatile is the inclusion of a laser engraver. The ability to engrave your miniatures means that you'll be able to personalize them even further with runes and other markings that need depth, as well as putting handy gameplay markings on your terrain pieces. This machine is also smart enough to warn you when the filament is running low. Another helpful aspect is the ability to control the 3D printer using Wi-Fi. All you need to do is make sure that your 3D printer and the device you want to use are connected to the same network. Overall, this is a capable 3D printer for the creation of miniatures that require a bit of experience to get the most out of. And that's the end of that chapter. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. It really grinds my gears.